this looks to me like what I expect a normal jet condensation trail to look like. This is not what I expect a normal jet condensation trail to look like. I don't know what this is. I do not understand why we are seeing sites like this. And this, strange lingering expanding jet trails. This does not look like a normal jet condensation trail to me. And neither does this. And this, what is this? Thank you for taking the time to watch this video. I first became aware of the new types of jet trails in April 2002. I have researched some of the possible explanations such as geoengineering for global warming mitigation, weather modification, and military related modification of the atmosphere. The trails, or some of them at least, may be being used in connection with the controversial HARP project based in Alaska. HARP, H-A-A-R-P, is an acronym for High Frequency Active Auroral Research Program. It has ominous capabilities and possibilities. It is a major area of study itself. There is much official information, including government documents and university studies that are on the drawing board and that are being promoted by various interests that provide clues that may be related to this disturbing new phenomenon. What is now being seen is very different than the thin, wispy contrails that were seen in the past, which quickly disappeared. In my experience, as I have seen, photographed, and videoed, the planes that fly low enough to be able to identify have no markings and do not appear to be commercial jets. Another major factor is that there is now a wide variety of recognizable types of trails with predictable dispersion rates and lingering characteristics. There are certain types of trails which are relatively short-lived lasting only seconds. There are other types that last for hours and spread, forming a sunlight filtering white haze, sometimes so dense that it forms a white overcast. The purpose of this video is to show some examples of what has been taking place in our sky. These clips were taken in Lake County, California. The video, as you will see, is very basic. It simply presents the images the camera recorded with my comments added. Some of my comments were made at the time of the recording and are included. Making this video has not been a labor of love. I have done it because I'm greatly troubled by what I've seen and learned. I feel very much trespassed upon and violated when I see our watch deep blue sky drastically altered and desecrated. We need to have the truth and we need to have our clear blue sky back. I have comments for most of the scenes, but for a few scenes, I think that they speak for themselves in that they are not ordinary jet condensation trails and possibly not condensation trails at all. There are a number of other valid possibilities and explanations for what is shown in this video. My own conclusion is that some, perhaps many, and possibly all of the unusual jet trails and the strange man-made fake clouds may well be the result of deliberate operations. I leave it to each viewer to decide for themselves.
This is the same trail a short time later. Here we see several types of trails. And trails that start and stop. Here, so it appears, are man-made clouds. Notice the line with whatever it is, is dispersing and drifting out. Fourth of July, uh, one or four PM in Lakeport. This clip was taken on a warm summer afternoon in Lakeport, California. The plane, as far as I can tell, is unmarked. We can see that the trail on our right is straight and narrow. The other trail fans out and overlaps and mixes with the narrow trail. How odd, shouldn't they match? Why don't they match? Why are they so different? As you will see, the plane continues its flight then the trails rapidly fade to nothing except some emissions continue from only one side.
Why are they coming from one side only? This four engine plane also appears to be unmarked. Notice that above the two obvious unusual trails is another thinner hazy trail. Why does a four engine plane leave these two odd trails with a very different third trail above? Now, let's look at this. What is that? This appears to be another unmarked plane. We can see one engine on each side. So why do we see these full wing spray like emissions that as you will see become oddly fragmented then intermittent?